Gilbert, are you well? I am, but I wish I could have risen to the challenge put before us, instead of just hiding here in the Longhouse. You were exactly where you needed to be, defending the people and yourself. I know. I just... Our forces outside were sufficient, and your father would have many unkind words for me if anything had happened to you. I know. I only wish my father's long shadow didn't darken my prospects here. I want to learn from you, not watch you. I have no doubt. Next time, then. Eivor, what a pleasure to see you. Oh dear, it feels like it's been so long. Valka, my friend. You're most welcome here. Are you well? Better than well. I am present. And your mother? My mother has found her peace at last. She walks through a world seen only in dreams and will forevermore. That is all any of us can hope for. Indeed. Come. How was your passage? Exhilarating. The waves and the wind were with us from the start. We flew like seabirds. And how are you? In spite of your stoic look, there is a brightness in your eyes that warms me. It may be a kind of hope. Our settlement is growing. The people are happy and I am looking forward to more. And... Your visions? They come and go. But leave all that aside. Let me help you with your things. This way. We found a fine spot for you at the foot of the hill. Hmm. Every hour we traveled, I tried to conjure in my mind some vision of this place. And how close were you? I saw the trees, and the water, and the rolling hill. But I could not foresee so much green. It is a magnificent... and calm in color, a balm for sea salted ice. Volka! Godzabo! What brings you? Hope there isn't a curse on the settlement or some such. Ha! <laughs> the only curse on this place is their great lout of a blacksmith. It is a rare feeling to travel across the sea and still find oneself at home. This place feels powerful, alive. Do you foresee great things for us? No need for foresight. I feel it in my heart. Is that Valka I see? What took you so long to follow? Wanted to ensure the place was up to snuff. We must talk again soon, Randvi, once I'm settled. And before my arms fall off, what is this I'm carrying? My heaviest reagents, of course. Lead, whalebone, flax of gold. Put this one to honest work. That is what I like to see. All these people you have brought here. This life you have built on these stranger shores. Does it please you? It does. To know that I've built this place and kept these people safe is a gift. You speak first of yourself when I ask this question. 
Which says more than you intend, I think. Salve, Eivor. Ad Meliora. Good day. And who is that fellow? Octavian. A strange man. I think you'll like him. You see there? Your home is just ahead. Tell me about your visions. They are as they have always been. Little has changed, save their clarity. With every return, the things I see feel less like dreams and more like memories. And does the All Father still appear before you? From time to time, yes. He speaks to me as well, but it feels mad to say such things aloud. I understand. You can put those just there. Thank you. And here we are. Lovely. Just as you promised. As soon as I am set up here, we can return to the matter of your visions. Valka, please. You are touched, Eivor. A conduit for godly tidings. Please, let me help. I may know a way to clarify these visions. An elixir that may open the door of your mind into the realm of the gods. If you think it would help, I can finish your home myself. Only give me some time. I would be grateful. Thank you, Eivor. Of course. And welcome home. This will do. Thank you, Eivor. Anything to help you feel at home? I am most at home helping others. May we return to the subject of your visions? We could, if you think it worth something. I need one more ingredient to finish an elixir for you. Look around the pond there. You will find what I require. Once brewed, this elixir will help you dive deeper into your visions. ...to see them more clearly. Lots of hungry fish here.
I have the plans you need. Good, good. Once added to the elixir, it will be ready to drink. In taking this, you will have access to the All Father's wisdom. You will walk the path of Odin and live as he lived so long ago. Prepare yourself for a journey into another time, another plane. The elixir is ready. It will taste like misery itself, but it will open your mind to the sights and sounds of the Nine Worlds. Can we do a bit of training? Absolutely. Much better. Do you need anything else? I must take... Make sure you talk to your raven regularly. They like that. Can you remind me what you do here? If you need something tattooed, you come here and I do it. And you can bring me whatever designs you come upon too. But of course, no shop, no tattoos. Build something for us when you can, and then we'll get working. I have to go. So long. Eivor, again, your people impress me with your skill. The invaders barely stood a chance. I have to go. Then go and... <laughs> ah! Those invaders never stood a chance. Not when you are armed with Gunnar's handiwork. Would like I can get you that one easy. Ah, look at how powerful it is now. You are looking power. I'm all. Until next we meet.
good to see you. What do you have? To... Have you got a con? I have requests that may or may not involve violence. There will be con. Have you got a con? Not. O One of our suppliers asked the sooner. I must. Goodbye. You wish you 
never been thought. <laughs> Have my thanks, Raven Bearer.
my friend. It is appreciated. Die Hunde mehr sind. Always night. Have you got a? I have request. There will be. Co what do you have to? I must go with your. You're just in time for new stock. What have you got? 
You should get that. Honestly. Made from only the finest materials. Eivor, you should definitely get this. Anything you find, bring it to me. You should buy that. You should buy that. Nothing else? I will see. Don't be a stranger! Hello, Eivor. Knut, what are you doing in here? Uh, Eivor, we need your help. Who's we? S Sylvie and Ira are in trouble. We went into the woods and... and... there's no time to explain. You need to come with me. Are they all right? No, they're hurt. And badly. Take me to them. Where are they? Not far. We need to hurry. What happened? Are they still in danger? Not if we get there soon. Which way now? This way! We're almost there! Come on, Eivor! Can't you run any quicker? Knut, you have to tell me what has happened! I can't! You won't understand! Even if I do, just, just trust me! What is this about? Sorry, Eivor. We had to trick you. But it wasn't my idea. It was Iris. Lying is not a good way to get my attention, children. But we found a dog that needs your help. She's caught in a trap down there. We thought you wouldn't come if you knew it was just a dog. Oh. That is not the sound of a dog, Ira. That is a wolf. But a wolf is a kind of dog, yes? My mother told me that. Of course, it's a kind of a dog. Listen to that sound. Awoo! Pure dog. Eivor, if you won't help us free her, we must do it ourselves. There's no need. Let me see what I can do. We must help her. Oh. She could be starving. Poor her. She's crying. We have to help. Her family probably misses her. Front door. I must be cautious opening it. <coughs> I'll free that wolf and pray to Tear that I needn't slay it in front of the children. The table is set. He never made it home. At least his end came quickly. These skulls bear teeth marks. The wolf must have helped him take them down. The 
the man liked his trophies. At least he leaves that legacy. Easy. Easy. You have a kind look to you, I think. Wait, wait, easy now! Deceived by children and shouting at wolves. I was a warrior once. Are you all right? Did you see the wolf? Yes, you freed her. You're amazing, Eivor. But she ran away and didn't even say thank you. She's going back to her family, maybe. Her mom and dad were probably very scared. Or her wolf husband. Maybe her wife. We don't know. But we do know it is time to get you three back to the settlement. Before your parents think you were eaten by wolves. Oh, all right. Chin up, Knut. You were very brave today. All of you. In future, you should not be exploring the woods alone, you understand? But you go off on your own all the time. Because I am very wise. And you have a lot to learn. Yes, but there are three of us. That balances everything. That is not quite how it works. like that at all. We should name her... Mouse. That makes no sense. I think we should call her... Chewy. Because she chews things. What do you think, Eivor? Chewy, I suppose. Good as any other. She's our best friend. Now we need to get home. All five of us. Fine. We only wanted to have an adventure like you, Eivor. And we did! And we got a new friend! Part of adventuring is learning a good lesson. Did you know that? Yes, the boring part. Well, have you children learned anything about wild animals today? Hmm, maybe. Yes, befriend them at any cost. They are perfect companions, and very kind. My mother always told me to avoid wild animals. Shows what she knows. How about we think quietly on what we have learned? Just until we get home? I think she's quite fond of you. I know she is. We saved her. She'd be rotting away by now. Just like that boar you killed, Eivor. You saw that? We see everything. Let's not tell your parents, all right? Now scamper off home and take your new friend with you.
Good to see you. I did. Put them... Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears. So have a look around. You may see a few new faces. I want to see the Alliance map. Those Dane invaders. They came from East Anglia, is that right? Yes. Dane invaders who serve a man called Ruid. He seems to be sowing discord among Saxons and friendly Danes alike. Years ago, the sons of Ragnar hoped to pacify the land. They appointed a steward named Finnir to find a suitable Saxon king. But the kingdom has fallen into ruins since, with no king and violent raiders ravaging what little peace remains. I suggest you make for East Anglia and find out what their steward is doing wrong. I will make the trip east, then. Speak to this Finnia myself. A good plan. Safe travels. I did. Put them right over there. Keep them out of your way when you aren't using them. I should go. I did. Put them right over there. Keep them out of your way when you aren't using them. Thank you. 